Hi, you guys. Um, I am here with an influencer uh, Best in Beauty 2018 box. It's the most reviewed, top rated beauty products of 2018 on the influencer site. Influencer is basically an, um, a beauty community. You can, no, no, it's more than that. It's an online community. You can join for free, and the more active you are on the site, the more likely you are to get free PR boxes, they call them box boxes, to unbox. I'm not nearly as active as I should be on there to ever get anything like that, but um, I uh, got an email that this was available for purchase, and it's over $300 of products for 50 bucks. And it's the, like I said, most reviewed top rated products. So, uh, and you get to look at what's in there. So I looked at the list and I thought, oh, ha, ha, heck yes, I want to try all of those many things. So um, I am going to unbox it. I believe that they're still available. So if you watch this and you decide that you think it's worth it for yourself, um, go ahead and, uh, sign up. It's free to sign up and hey, maybe you'll start to get active on there and you'll get free PR boxes as well. So it just looks like this. I think that they just kind of, well, let's see. There's that. And then uh, it does have a little pamphlet in it. Let's see what it has to say in this pamphlet. Oh, it, it, it's a fourfold thing and it basically it lists each of the products it lists how many stars out of five the product has on their website so it's reviews within the influencer site and they don't check anywhere else it's just within the influencer site so for instance um this kat von d full-size liquid lipstick uh, has 4.56 out of 5 stars on their website, and it's based on 50,800 um, plus reviews. So that's basically what this is. It has every product and tells you how many stars and how many reviews. So I'm so excited. Uh, it's got some more stuff. What is this? Um... That's just some descriptors on the products and some coupons. Coupons. Oh my gosh. So this is a full-size Tresemme Extra Firm Hold Hairspray. So let's see. I am actually, I'm, I'm actually going to take some time and I'm going to, you can skip through if you don't want to see all this, uh, this much information, but it's got this full-size Tresemme Hairspray. And I am, oh, there it is. It's 4.52 out of five stars, and it's got over 2,800 reviews. So, and I believe that the, they did a 2017 best of box as well. Um, but, okay, so it doesn't have a huge amount of reviews, but it's one of the top rated, top reviewed products. So that's a full size, full size hairspray. Goodness me. Um, okay, okay, so they're, they've kind of bundled some of the products in. So some of them are full size, some of them are sample or travel size. Um, so here is a Real Techniques by Sam and Nick Miracle Complexion Sponge. Um, I will probably put this in a future giveaway. I don't really like to wear um, foundation on my face. Maybe it's because I've never discovered a really nice foundation where you, it feels like you're not wearing foundation. I just don't like the way it feels. And I don't, I don't think that I need it all that much. Um, I definitely need other things, but uh, yeah. Anyway, so that'll probably go in a future giveaway. Um, and then, oh, oh, I was going to take a moment and... So that one had 4.65 out of 5 stars and 41,100 plus reviews. So that's got a lot of reviews. Okay, the next thing is a shave cream and moisturizer by Eos. I have seen Eos, uh, usually I see their hand soap. So this is pomegranate raspberry and it has uh, I'm not seeing it. 
One moment, please. <laughs> oh, here it is. It does not look like this in the pamphlet. In, in the pamphlet, it's blue. Okay, so it's a travel size shave cream, and it's got 4.34 out of 5 stars and over 9,000 reviews on the Influencer site. It smells good. It smells fruity. It would because it's pomegranate raspberry. It's uh, it's nice. It seems nice. I have a shave cream I already use that I really really enjoy. So this is a really good travel size uh, shave cream. Um, I'm sure it's fine. I have been learning a lot about um, cruelty free products because actually I started to become aware of it as a FabFitFun member, and you know. I eat meat. I, I'm not like a big, huge proponent. I'm not trying to force anyone to think about this, but I've been trying to steer my brain into the direction of being aware of what's cruelty-free and what's not. So I did look that up, and this one's not cruelty-free. EOS is not cruelty-free. I was a little bit surprised about that because I feel like I see them in more... Um, I don't know why I was surprised, but I was surprised. And then Tresemme is not cruelty free either. I will use these products. I just will keep it in mind and maybe not fall in love with them, try not to buy them. And anyway, that's just something that's been on my brain. I've also been um, um, really into learning about the ingredients and products. And um, I watched Tati. She's a huge YouTuber. And she recommended in a uh, video recently to download the app Think Dirty. And it's an app where you can scan the barcode of your beauty product and it'll let you know if it has um, any bad for you ingredients in the product. I haven't used it quite yet. I should actually go get my phone. Ooh, I'm going to go get my phone. I'm going to go get my phone. And I Okay, so I um, got a little excited, but I'm back and I am um, going to find that app. It's called Think Dirty. It looks like that. Um, and you can, so let's, let's scan this Tresemme barcode and see if anything happens. Uh, so I've got the barcode thing on. It's scanning. It says loading. Uh, okay, that's great. So this has five dirty ingredients. So it came up like that and it's all fragrance and perfume. So the, those those come up as dirty, I guess. Anyway, I, I, I just learned about this app. So that's not going to steer me away from trying it out. I'm just learning and it's fun to learn. Okay, so what have we got here? This is the Laura Mercier Ready, Set, Go Deluxe Mini Translucent Loose Setting Powder and Mini Velour Puff. Uh, there you go. You can read it that way. And I, uh, again, I don't wear, I wear uh, some makeup, but just the uh, foundation and powder the, and blush and those kinds of things I don't really wear. Uh, but let's see. So this is it has 4.73 out of 5 stars based on 31,800 plus reviews. Um, so yeah, it looks like this. I um, maybe I'll put this in a future giveaway as well. Um, so far we have it. I, there are a few products in here I'm really super excited about. I haven't gotten to them yet. Um, Okay, so this one's kind of funny, and this one's not cruelty-free, but I've been wanting to try it, and I I just bought at uh, TJ Maxx a little triple sample pack of this, but it's the Batiste Dry Shampoo, and I have just seen this everywhere. People just love this stuff. So, um, I'm so excited. Uh, this is 4.52 out of 5 stars, and it's got over 33,000 reviews, Batiste. Um... Yeah. Uh, so actually, I when I was looking up that this one was cruelty free or not, there it, it was kind of um, hard to really find out because there's this label right there. You can kind of see it, it says vegan right here. And then it says uh, not tested on animals. 
And so if you look at the PETA website, they, they talked about how they called and they got the runaround so they couldn't certify with them, them with the Leaping Bunny um, certificate of really being cruelty free. Anyway, um, regardless, I'm going to try this out. I've heard it's really, really amazing. So that one I am excited about. Um, and then this is, uh, this is a mascara, which I need a new mascara. And I just bought the Great Lash by Maybelline that a lot of people, I've heard really good things about it. And I don't like it so much. Um, and it's just because I feel like um, it doesn't go on very well on my eyelashes. I get better results from other mascaras as far as voluminosity. I'm so excited. I feel like I'm really hyper. Maybe I'm not. I'm also tired, so maybe it's a wash. This is Unique, and it's spelled like Y-O-U, Unique. So Unique, Moodstruck Epic Mascara. Maybe if I do this thing that everyone else does, you guys can see this. Yeah, there you go. Um, and so this one, I need a new mascara. Yay, Moodstruck Epic Mascara. 4.43 out of 5 stars, and it's got over 2,900 reviews. This is what the spoolie looks like. It looks a little crowded, a little crowded and a little clumpy, but I'll do, I like to do actual reviews of the products that I um, show you my unboxings and first impressions of. So I will let you know uh, what I think of this mascara. I might do a a mascara video. Um, anyway, okay. So did I tell you how? Yeah, I did tell you all about what it says in here. Okay, so this is a full size SPF 50 um, sunscreen. Yeah, right on. <laughs> uh, this one's 4.58 out of five stars based on over 1600 reviews. This is great. I, why not? I, I try to SBF all the time. It's I remember it saying it was gonna be full size, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm misremembering. It doesn't say here. But uh I mean it's a good size, that's for sure. But I just would think they would probably have a bigger size available. Let's see how it smells. I don't like sunscreen smell. It smells a little bit like sunscreen smell. It's sealed, but I can smell it and I don't want to open it because I, I want to make sure that I get as much life out of the product as I possibly can. Um, so that's that's great. That's great. So great. <laughs> okay. Okay. I think I'm calming down a little bit. Um, let's see. Yeah, they bundled them into little packages. I don't know why. So here is. This is ColourPop. Uh, oh, it's a shadow. Super Shock Shadow by ColourPop. It looks like that. Um, one moment, please. It looks like honeycomb. Okay, again, uh, $50 over $300 worth of product, and if you just simply sign it up for an influencer account, I think you can go to their store and buy it. It's still available, I checked. Uh, so the ColourPop shadow, I'm looking for it, is 4.67 out of 5 stars, over 10,000 reviews. Okay. I've been wanting to play with eyeshadow. Um, that's another thing that I haven't really worn much of, but I've been wanting to play with some high quality eyeshadow. I'm sure there's some out there that will go on well, will stay well. I watch, like I said, I watch Tati and I'm um, trying to learn more about makeup. So this is Becca, uh, Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed Highlighter, and it's 4.4 out of 5 stars. 23,100 plus reviews. And so this is what it looks like. I did read up on Becca. Becca used to be cruelty free and they sold out to, they sold out, they sold their company to Estee Lauder. Can't really blame them, right? I mean, <laughs> they've made millions, I'm sure, if not more. 
But anyway, they used to be cruelty free and now Estee Lauder is not. And with cruelty free, it just really usually means that they sell in China because China's laws require that you test on animals. Again, I'm not trying to push that on anyone. It's just kind of been something I'm learning about. So, um, back, uh, pressed highlighter. Okay. <laughs> back to the task at hand. So this is really, really cute little thing. I'm trying to be like, oh, <sighs> well, I just, um, all of the product just fell out. I don't mind, except for that I'm afraid to move and rub any of it into my carpet or anything like that. That's okay. Becca Breath Press Highlighter. I will never be able to tell you what I think of this. Oh boy. Okay, so now this is a cover look girl. I'm not gonna open it and hold it up like that. This is a cover girl chocolate scented. Okay, now I'm gonna open it. Um smells like cocoa. Anyway, it's a choco chocolate scented palette. And something that's awesome about CoverGirl is right when I was learning about all this cool cruelty free stuff in November of 2018, CoverGirl went cruelty free. They pulled all of their stock from China where they require animal testing. That's huge. That's a big company and it makes me very happy because my favorite drugstore mascara is by CoverGirl. But um that's a big deal. I thought that that was really cool. Okay, Wet n Wild, also cruelty free. Um, anyway, so this is their highlighting powder. And oh, I forgot to tell you the ratings on this. Back to the cover girl. This, I was, uh, bleh. <sighs> um, the cover girl is True Naked Chocoholic Eyeshadow Palette, 4.41 out of 5 stars. 6,700 plus reviews. I have highlighter powder all over the place. Oh, I'm gonna just jump it into the box. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's the CoverGirl chocolate eyeshadow palette. Um, and then the highlighting powder by Wet n Wild is, oh, uh, Mega Glow Highlighting Powder, 4.67 out of 5 stars, 13,600 plus reviews. And Wet n Wild is cruelty free. I think I already said that. Um, okay, so here's another bag full of goodies. So this is Pons. Um, Pons is one of the products, that, the lines that's um, not cruelty free, which is kind of a bummer because I really like their stuff. That's actually a little, it's kind of got a soapy scent. What is it, you ask? It is a Pond's Dry Skin Cream Rich Hydrating Facial Moisturizer. So it's a facial moisturizer, and it smells kind of soapy. It doesn't have a bad smell, but it smells more like it would be a cleanser. But okay, I'll try it, and I'll let you know what I think. This one has... 4.4 out of 5 stars, over 9,200 reviews. It's a cute little guy. 3.9 ounces. It's a good size. Um, I think it's their, wouldn't be their travel size. I don't know. It's big for a sample size, if that's what it is. Okay. This I'm so excited to try. I have seen this in the drugstore so many times, and um, <laughs> my hair loves the beach, it loves the salt water, it just eats it right up and then becomes perfectly curly without any product. And so they just kind of sold themselves to me based on what it's called, Beach Babe Texturizing Sea Salt Spray. <laughs> it just sounds perfect. Um, and I'm very excited to try this. I saw that this was in the box and this was actually one of the main reasons <laughs> where I was like, yep, that's for me. Uh, so this is 4.17 out of 5 stars, and it's over 14,000 reviews. So that's the lowest rated thing in this box so far. I'm still ridiculously excited to try it. Um, there's still more. Okay, so this is Jergens. My leg is going to sleep. This is the Jergens um, Natural Glow. 
Daily Moisturizer. So it looks like that. And then it has 4.14 out of five stars and it's over 3,700 reviews. Let's see if I can smell it. This just smells like lotion, like, um, Oh, it is a little bit scented. It's very, it's it not very scented, but it's got a scent. I, I don't know how to describe it. Kind of like the 1990s perfume kind of scent. Like when you, oh, it smells like when you would open a Seventeen magazine. That's very specific to my age group. Um, or even a Cosmo. Like it just smells like the perfume sample smell and magazine smell. It smells like that. That's what it reminds me of. It's nice. It's a good memories. Um, okay, so did I already look in, in here for it? I did. Okay, so that's that. And it is, it's just a lotion. It's just a lotion. Okay. So now we have the NYX NYX Matte Finish Long Lasting Setting Spray. This is for makeup, I believe. <laughs> That's how much I know about makeup. Oh, I'm losing light. It's getting darker and darker outside, but I think you can still see me okay here. Let me, I should get a little closer though. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm losing light. Um, <laughs> bear with me, please. Okay, so this is the setting spray by NYX, and it is 4.24 out of 5 stars, 24,800 plus reviews. So I, I will, I don't wear makeup that needs to be set. So maybe one day, or maybe that'll go on a giveaway one day. Okay. Uh, this is a Shea Sugar Scrub. I love sugar scrubs. I love scrubs. I love skincare. That's where I really start to get excited. Um, this is 4.74 out of 5 stars, and it's got over 2,600 reviews. So, let's see if I can... Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub Coconut Lime. Oh just right you just open it right up there's no protective thing or anything it smells good I don't really smell any lime it smells kind of coconut co coconutty just has kind of a beachy little bit coconutty scent it smells good I like it it does um, it's interesting. It looks like it's, it's got a strange gel-like, uh, look to it that I am surprised by, but I'm sure it's amazing. People rate it highly, so I will try that and let you guys know what I think. Ugh, this highlighter powder is everywhere. Okay, so this is Origins. And Origins is owned by Estee Lauder, so they aren't Estee Lauder, so they aren't cruelty free. But I've been really wanting to try Origins. Um, this is the Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream to Brighten and Depuff, and it looks like that. It's just a little guy, but eye cream, so it'll probably last a, a while. Um, and this one has four. It's got highlighter powder. 4.28 out of 5 stars based on over 12,000 reviews. So I'm really excited to try this. Really excited to try Origins. Um, okay, so now we have Love, Beauty, and Planet, which is, you would think that this one would be cruelty-free, but I learned that it's not. Uh, okay. I should still be 
scanning some of them to see with that app that I showed you at the beginning of this video in case you missed it. It's an app called Think Dirty that you can use to scan the barcode on your um, beauty products and see if it has any um, harsh chemicals or uh, potentially harmful chemicals uh, in your product. Okay, so this is a shampoo. Oh, it'd be cool if it came with a conditioner as well. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> um, so, Love, Blue Beauty, and Planet. This is... Oh, so you... Oh, oh, that's kind of cool. You were going to get a surprise product from the entire line of Love, Beauty, and Planet. So, you could have gotten a body lotion a deodorant, um, the shampoo, or it's hard to read because it's just little pictures of the products. Anyway, so I got the shampoo and it has 4.48 out of 5 stars and it has over 630,000 reviews. Wow. Oh, I didn't mean to Oh, it says it's Muru 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 Butter and Rose. M U R U M U R U. Muru Muru Butter and Rose. Um, so it smells like rose. That's what I smell. I am excited to try it. I wish I had the conditioner to pair it with, but it says it's. It also says it's vibrancy for color treated hair. And acts of love for our planet, which is silly because I, I, what I, the research I did, they're not cruelty free. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, you do a Google search and who do you trust, right? So, um, I don't have color treated hair, but I guess that doesn't really matter. Uh, but okay, cool. And this I'm excited about too. I'm so excited about everything. I'm going bonkers. Um, so this is the Oribe Dry Texturizing Spray, 4.1. I don't know what I'm doing, but 4.17 out of 5 stars based on over 2,700 reviews. And this is insanely popular as well. They had it in the add-ons for FabFitFun. I did not purchase it because it was one of the pricier items. And I just, you know, was paring down my cart. But uh, when I saw that it was in this, I was excited to at least get to try it out I should have closed my closet door. That looks bad. Anyway, okay, so that's that one. Oh, what is the rating? Oh, did, I already said it. I already said what the rating was. Okay, and so this is the Kev on the lip color. I'm so excited. I'm already wearing lip color. Otherwise, I would just put it right on. It's a full size Kat Von D lip color in the shade Lolita, right there. Um, and they're so cute. It's my first Kat Von D product ever. Uh, I'll let you know what I think later. Um, this is Everlasting Liquid Lipstick, 4.56 out of 5 stars, and it's based on 50,800 plus reviews. Yay! I have never tried her stuff before. This is another dry shampoo. Another, because we had the Bautiste, 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 not Bautiste, Bautiste already. This one's Amika dry shampoo. Super cute bottle. Um, it's got 4.52 out of 5 stars, and that's from over... 33,000, no, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Scratch that. It's got 4.59 out of 5 stars, and that's out of over 1,900 reviews. I will let you know what I think of this and all of this stuff. Um, at some point, just stay tuned with my channel. I've been way into trying all these products and product reviews and whatnot. Oh, more Origins! Wait a moment. So I got the same thing in two little sizes from Origins, which I'm not upset about, but I am a little confused about. 
Um, I'm just trying to figure out if there's an actual difference between these two things. Refreshing eye cream to brighten and deep puff. This, 0.5 ounces. This might be a full size. Origins isn't cheap. This is probably $29 at Sephora. Um, let's see, refreshing eye cream to brighten and depuff. And that's what this little guy says, too. So, I mean, I'm not upset. It's just I got two of them in different sizes. Okay, of course I'm not upset. But And then there were some little packets of products. Uh, that Becca highlighter thing just got everywhere. Um, so this one is a sample of the DP Hue Apple Cider Vinegar Scalp Scrub. I'm excited to try some of their stuff. This has 4.12 out of 5 stars, over 130 reviews, so it's not very reviewed yet, but um, I am I'm excited to try that. Seems like it will be pretty clarifying. Um, this is Garnier, which Garnier, Fructis, they are not cruelty-free, but I love Garnier stuff. If you want an inexpensive, inexpensive drugstore line of products that usually is pretty on point, I would highly recommend Garnier. Okay, so that said, this is the Color Vibrancy Treatment One Minute Hair Mask. This seems geared toward people with colored hair too. I do not have my hair is not dyed, it is its natural color. This is 4.32 out of 5 stars, and it has 800 plus reviews. So it looks like the less reviewed products, they just gave you little sample packets, which is a really good idea on the behalf of the company to try to get people, more people to use it. Um, this is Alba, and I love Alba. However, they just, just the, they just discontinued my favorite, favorite, favorite hair product, and I am, my husband used it, I am still searching for a new favorite, and I may never find it, but anyway, so this is Alba Botanica Hawaiian Detox Warming Mud Mask, and I love masks, I do one practically every night, this is 4.11 out of 5 stars, and it's got over 1,100 reviews. So that's it. That's everything. But there's so much stuff. So much stuff. I'm so excited. I'm, I'm a little embarrassed with my behavior right now. I'm so excited. Um, stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you've used any of this stuff and uh, what you think of the products. And again, I think that this is still available. All you have to do is go to influencer.com and sign up for free and go in and you can get this $50 over $300 worth of products. All right. Thank you guys. Have a good day. Bye.